Family and friends gathering to remember the life of a loved one they lost after she went missing over a year ago. How she's being remembered tonight and the message they have for the public that may be going through similar struggles. Good evening. Thanks for joining us here at 11 o'clock. I'm Tim Callahan and I'm Jessica Harrington tonight. A gathering at the Liberty Bell downtown to honor the life of Jay Bornstein. It was about a year ago that Jay went missing and after searching for days, her body was found at Hart Park. 23 ABC's Alyssa Flores was at that vigil tonight and has more on how she's being remembered. Listen. Tim Jessica, like you mentioned, it was about a year ago that Jay Bornstein's family learned that she had taken her own life. Tonight, family and friends gathered here to remember her. They say they will work to make this a safer and softer world for trans youth like Jay. A year later, Jay Bornstein's legacy lives on. It's so important to push that notion of love and support for trans people because, like I said, we are one of the most targeted groups. The 19-year-old fought for the equality of transgender people like her until her death a year ago. After missing for several days, Bornstein's body was found at Hart Park. Her death ruled a suicide. I wish I could have done more to support her. Um, I don't know what led Jay to her decision, but I wish I would have known she was struggling and not been afraid to reach out and offer support. Friends and family gathered Tuesday night to remember her and to send a message to other trans individuals who may be struggling. I'm humbled and I'm grateful and I'm amazed at the love and the kindness and the light, the dedication of, of these people of, of our Bakersfield community. They came together a year ago to help find Jay and they're still here a year later, you know, still working for a safer, softer world. The Bornsteins say their daughter's passing has instilled a new sense of meaning in what she advocated for. There's a real sense of determination to work in advocating for the rights of all people, transgender people, LGBTQ, all people. Everybody has basic human rights and they all need to be respected. We're very honored and we're very humbled that the community has allowed Jay to be a positive force for change, to protect the most vulnerable in our society, to, to keep pushing the message that Jay stood for. Stand up every time. Don't let anything slide. When you see disrespect toward another person, you see, you know, uh, hurtful behaviors or bullying or anything of the kind, stand up.